thinking about the Weeble S and connecting it to the Sony A7. I do apologise if it if I'm only using the A7 and I don't know the connectors for any other cameras. Um, anyway, to begin with, this box will give you everything you need to connect the control leads for this camera and this gimbal. Uh, you might have to further buy this HDMI cable package which will give you a short HDMI lead to mini HDMI which is connected to the top here. Then at the very bottom of this camera is the control socket which uh, controls the camera and that is connected and uh, labelled number one in your box um, which is connected to the right side of this HDMI box and that will let you transmit images from here through HDMI transmission box and into your uh, ZY play app. Furthermore you need to connect this back lead. This socket actually allows you to charge short this um, box um, because it does have a battery inside so you need to charge it up and as well as that you need this lead which goes from the back of this box into um, this gimbal to the side you get two two slots really one at the back and one at the front the front one I'm using as a focus mode adjustment or a zoom adjustment for this focus motor for this uh, 24 to 240 lens as you can see <laughs> once it's connected you're you've just about sorted out the hardware making sure that you mount this underneath there uh, there's a tutorial about it so you'll probably need to uh, look into that but I'm just um, showing you the technical aspects of how to get this working. Right, once you've connected that up, you need to power this on. And then uh, you'll see that it's charging with the blue light. Make sure you uh, unlock the uh, gimbals or else you'll get that beeping noise. Now I'll just hold down and reset this POV button. There. And then switch on your camera. And all that. So that should be working. Now you power on this transmitter. transmitter. Press and hold. Should be working. Uh, more important thing is here is um, controls. You need to press down, go into the camera, and then um, select CSS. CSS and then allow it to control select that and it should allow the HDMI um, to control the camera and the gimbal now you just need to connect it to the um, app connect to the app you can see that the uh, Zuyun uh, ident has uh, appeared so you just tap onto that um, the password is one two three four five six seven eight, and it should connect to it. Um, I've already connected, so it should be all right. Right, select um, ZY Play App, and then go into uh, Weeble S, but don't connect to the first page because that just only does. The controls for for the gimbal only. Instead, you select along to the transmission box pictured here. Enter now. 
there you have it. Then you connect to this little icon here, which is the picture icon with a line in it. Connect it and you should be uh, seeing this. And as you can see that, um, you'll have uh, controls here which will allow you to uh, control camera up or down. And in L mode, you should go left and right. Uh, make sure that you press L mode here to do that. Uh, the roll axis is here. And then reset is that little line there. As well as that, um, this icon here, I think it's tracking mode. So if I press onto that and then use that, it should track. Um, kind of works, but it's not as reliable as something like the uh, Ronin version of that, which is okay. Anyway, um, you've got other controls here as well as the PF and the L and uh, Go mode and what have you. Um, there's these controls here, which is um, settings for the gimbal itself. Camera mode, adding LUTs, um, going live, which can be fun. Just go press live and then connect to your Facebook. And you should be able to log in and go live with this your phone image yeah there you go as well as image which can give you um, a histogram or in my case prefer to have a grid with the rule of third sight connecting the a7 camera with the Weeble S you'll just need a different lead altogether if you take out all of this um, this lead and the two leads to connect into the camera uh, all you need now is to use this USB type C lead uh, which is labeled L N M B U C B O Z B O one, and this um, alone is connected to this, replacing this lead, and the second socket. If you take this out, this out will connect. To this second socket on your camera and once you've done that you go into this um, menu system and you basically go into the camera right click and then go into anything but Sony so uh, take out of go out of CCS go into the next one up and then you should be able to connect to the shows you the uh, aperture 
value and I've already connected this lead to the USB-C or middle socket of this A7 camera and it should work properly with transport so press record here and it records press again stops recording aperture and other values so if you want to use this uh, gimbal without the HDMI transmission uh, you can do so with this different uh, lead. I hope that this uh, video helps you to sort out your Weeble S. Please like and subscribe to this channel and I'll try and get you some more information uh, about this system.